Hello fellow weirdos. Welcome back to some um cradle with me. Uh I just gloriously lost the game in this uh, mini game pavilion which I found just as annoying as the others. Right now I haven't been playing for a while so I don't remember what the heck well I was up to. Oh <gasps> I don't have the sword! Oh yeah and also you have to do everything again if you reset the game. Right, right, right. special quality those kids had. They had exceptionally developed visual perception. Visual and aesthetic. For them, the shape, color, and the like of surrounding objects was of critical importance. Some things were beautiful in their eyes, others the definition of ugly. And here's the kicker. They were always in consensus. But it was that very ability that ultimately became their plight. The particulars, however, I still do not know. Right, so here I come up to a bit that I have actually played already, but I botched up the recording, so I'm gonna do it again. Ah, oh, okay, here it is. Also, because I don't remember much anyway, it's okay that I have to do some stuff again. Basically, Ida is gonna remember some stuff uh, about uh, this figure here and this this whole situation here. Also, I think we need to make another flower de delivery. Maybe I heard the chime. Ah, come at me, bro. Poof! I think this is the first time that I'm recording with the new computer, so I'm getting used to the uh, much larger picture here. Also, the lighting is kind of cool with the new one. Oh, okay, the tram isn't here. Let's put this away. I uh, also grab a stick, just because. Now, let's see if I remember how to operate this. Okay, sit down. I think I had some nice flowers picked last time, but of course, since stuff resets between uh, between sessions, I might have had some progress that I lost. Oh, what about the batteries? Okay, so Oh I think you need like three batteries then you can then you can rig them up but I think I never got that far. Okay, at least the door opens all the way now. Hello I'm gonna leave the door open. Hey! Ring the battery. Here it is. Let's replace it. Go ahead. But you'll need 
to switch me off first. Alright. Okay, okay. Again. Well, no way around that. Yeah. Shut me down. See you in a minute. I don't remember if we Okay, so I actually have to go through the moves. Uh, wait. Okay, yeah, replace it. Doesn't integrate with the web. Anibish, 
There's another network terminal underneath the TV. It's functional only without power. If you can power it up, I'll be able to get online. Help me understand something. What? How did the kids react to seeing a mechanical body? The same way as an organic one. They puked. But then how did they interact with the staff? Their bouts of morphophobia were suppressed. The complex was equipped with these emitters. I don't know how they worked, but exposure to them enabled the kids to communicate with the staff as well as among themselves. Got it. Uh, I wanna, I wanna ask. Oh, okay. I wanna Did ask about the thing. Channel? Not yet. No. Oh. So she doesn't explain. So I remember this is where I was stuck last time, and I think this is what I haven't. Yeah, uh, this is what I haven't uh, got on record because I watched the recording. There's supposed to be a remote somewhere here. So essentially, I think that we are maybe uh, a copy of one of those children who visited the facility. Also, I suspect that uh, the, the facility function must have been something else, really. Uh, is there a remote here? Uh, also, she she hasn't said it yet, but uh, but she is not the original. She's allegedly a copy of herself, and uh, and 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 now I don't remember. I guess I'll just have to keep on playing for a bit. Also, I think I was supposed to make some copies, maybe. Ah, okay, so there was one battery. So yeah, any, anything I have done in previous sessions is lost but I also kind of remember it so it's it's kind of confusing I, rem I remember that I put the panel here but where exactly I think it had a okay here and there's supposed to be a third battery somewhere Also, I distinctly remember that there was a remote control for the thingy terminal thing. What was that? open those? More importantly, do I have to open those maybe? Uh, okay, two batteries in. What's this? Okay, let's look back inside. Ah, yeah, so basically, we have information inside the yurt that seems to indicate a certain year and 
uncertain identity. But somehow, I think none of this uh, actually, n none of this is actually true. I think uh, the time might be very different from what we think it is. And uh, also, I'm not entirely certain that this is reality reality. This might be some sort of virtual thing. I mean, the sky kind of gives me the suspicion that maybe, maybe this is virtual altogether. Oh, okay, so... Never mind then. Two batteries in. I need another one. Come on. I used to have it. I I used to know where where the third battery was. Yeah, this is something else. Understand something. What? How did the kids react to seeing a mechanical body? Nope. The same way as an organic. But then how yeah. did they interact with the staff? Got it. We already got it. Waterfall. Got it. Got it. There totally was a remote here. I remember it. Looks like I need to look around. I don't think there was a battery in the flower dome. But let's look around around the house itself. Hello.
who's up here? Oh, what do we have here? is pretty good. Yeah, so the whole new computer situation means that I can use uh, higher settings than I used to. Which is nice. But also the screen res looks very different, which I'm not used to, so not only do I have to manage stuff, oh okay here's the third battery, stuff that I don't remember I also have to adjust with the visuals that I'm not used to okay so this works remote I believe this is uh, this is as far as I got last time so I didn't realize how to turn on the power oh okay I guess I, that's what the third battery was for maybe I missed that one because I don't remember the light turning on last time. Okay, so we have the light. But where's the remote? Oh, okay. I see it. I see it. Remote, remote, remote. The reason is both <gasps> simple and evident. Simultaneous existence of two copies of the same person gives rise to problems we are not prepared to tackle, as clearly demonstrated by the sorrowful experience of the recent past. For now, strict prohibition on duplication and forced deactivation of existing duplicates remain the only solution to the situation. Deactivated neurocopies are retired into secure storage facilities for likely reactivation in the future, when a legitimate solution is found. This is one of the cases when... <gasps> oh no! Okay, I think this is a good place to take a little pause. I will finish this episode here and carry on the next one. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you then. Bye!